Hey, Jared, welcome to the show. How's it going? Good, how are you? Thanks for calling in today. What's going on with you? Album release day. Big Super day. Show. Yeah. I love it. Uh, swim team out now. Is it, is it very gratifying to you guys to have this thing out there in the public? Yeah, totally. I mean, always when you when you finish something to completion, you be able to get it out, get it mixed, get it mastered, get it in the hands of the fans. It's a good feeling. I think the best feeling is, is finally getting the plan live and really see what what songs the the fans really dig. Have you guys not been playing the new material live? Is this the first time you guys are going to be playing it in front of people? We've been doing um, the singles that we released live, and we've been doing maybe like one or two little teasers throughout some shows here or there. Nice. Uh, How did you guys uh, enjoy your time at Angry Orchard? You were just there a couple weeks ago. It was beautiful. That was was awesome. Nice. A lot of of good orchard. (laughs) A lot of of apples and stuff. A lot of apples. Uh, It was beautiful. We had a tree house. There's a lot of cider. Uh, we played an acoustic show. It was cool. It was definitely cool. Very nice. Uh, the new uh, video for Vacation uh, features uh, a man that is near and dear to my heart, Mr. Belding. I don't know his real name, but... I don't. I forgot. <laughs> uh, who came up with the idea of putting him in the video? Dennis. His name's Dennis. Dennis. Dennis, Dennis. is responsible. Yeah. Uh, th- th- uh, this guy... Kid Ryan at our label is a, like a huge save by the cell, like nerd, like nerd, knows like everything about it. Like, soup. And we all grew up on it, so we knew what was up. And he pitched us the idea and said that he'd already reached out to Belding and, and that he was in it or that he was in for it. And we we're like, yeah, don't even pitch us any other music video ideas. That's hilarious. <laughs> I, 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 I planned on having Belding doing a lot more debauchery in the video but <laughs> unfortunately he still does like you know things as belding so under contract we can't have him smoking and drinking and you know burning the school down <laughs> i guess he's got an image to uphold yeah yeah he's trapped in in uh belding detention forever yeah well he's made a life out of it he's probably probably doing okay probably he's doing a great right. guy that's awesome now just uh sticking with the theme of uh vacation <laughs> You guys sing a lot about, um, you know, um, having the job you want. You never work a day in your life, I guess. Uh, How do you guys keep things from getting stale? Uh, I think by writing albums like this, you know, not 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 putting ourselves in a box and and always kind of being this genreless band that we've luckily enough been to build a fan base that appreciates that and be able to go in and express ourselves and write music that we're inspired by at the time. So each album, you know, we don't go in and say, okay, we want to lean more hip hop on this album. Okay. We want to lean more alternative on this album. Okay. We want to lean more acoustic on this album. We just go in and we start writing music and then it starts coming out. And and obviously whatever we're inspired by, by the time you can feel that in in the albums that are coming out. But, um, and, and also I think, for somebody like me that couldn't hold a job before this, you know, I was, it was, it was one job to another to another because I was just so bored and I, I, I couldn't enjoy it. And um, with with doing this, there's so many sides to it. You know, you get to go out and you get to be on the road. Then you get to come home and then you get to create. And then there's music videos that you get to be a part of. And then there's designing the merch that you get to be a part of. And then there's just, you know, the fan interactions. Like there's so many different parts of it that, you never really get bored. And once, if you do kind of get burnt on one side of it, there's always something else that you can go back to. Very nice. Well, we're excited to have you guys back in the region uh, in November, a show in Albany. Uh, we're a little bit south of that, but we're going to make sure everybody knows about that show and uh, yeah. that uh, you guys are going to be back around in a little bit. So uh, thank you very much for everything you've done for the station. And uh, we look forward to crossing paths sometime in the near future. Of course. Thank you guys for the support. We appreciate it.